Hello folks. Well here are a couple of unusual flying machines you don't normally see flying around in your backyard. You know with all the reports of UFO activity around the world you have to ask yourself with 90% of the world carrying around HD cameras with their phones where are all those UFO pictures? <laughs> so after I show you my UFO encounter I'll pass on some more info on the eFlight expert so hang on. Whoa, did you see that? <laughs> there it is again. I think it's shooting at me. I'm going to land and see if I can get a shot of it. Oh, right through the airplane car wash. <laughs> Well, look at that. It's a Star Trek Enterprise knockoff. So now it's no longer a UFO, it's an IFO. They're trying to beam me up. Where's my weapon? Take that, you guys. Wow, I got a close-up now. And look, it's speeding up and it's it's gone. Wow. Okay, before I start talking about the Xvert, I'm gonna show you something on DX8 and some of the spectrum. This annoying beep. Start stop, start stop, beep, beep, beep. That's on the timer here. Okay, the timer, when you go up it starts counting down. So to get rid of that beep all you have to do is go into your setup go down here to where it says timer four minutes now here's where you've got your voice so I have every minute voice 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 and then every minute tone when you go to the next window, this shows start and stop of the timer control, which is this right here. So I have it inhibited, inhibited, and then when the timer resets, I have it set for tone. So that's it. Go back to the front. And there we are. Volume 100. Well, note this method only stops the start and stop of the timer tones, not the actual countdown in minutes and seconds and other warnings that are easily set. I usually start my countdown at 1 minute, then 30 seconds, 20 seconds, and then 10 to 0. I do it all in the voice mode. I have my first warning set at 1 minute, and then it will go to 30 seconds, 20 seconds, and then countdown, just like this. Now it's counting up. Okay, another thing you've seen, I've made some modifications. I put these uh, skewer sticks on here so that the propellers don't hit the ground when it flips over. It, it flips over a lot, mostly on landing. And if you do crash, these things break. I put big drops of amazing goop on here, which stiffens this up. And I've also, of course, changed the props. You've seen my videos on that. And one of the things is, when this lands, you have to shut it off as soon as it lands because it doesn't shut off, it stays running. Okay, one of the things is there is no left and right aileron on this. It's the rudder that causes it to do this. It's not like a quadcopter, there's only two motors. So the only thing that controls the turn is this. And when you're landing, this. Now, if the wind is blowing, and you come down, and you slightly do that, 
it's going to tip over. You know, if the wind is blowing this way, you'll have a hard time getting back because you can't fight this. You have to fly back sideways into the wind. Okay? And as soon as it shuts down, you have to shut it off right away. You have to be on that button. Do not try to move the controls when it sets down because invariably you want to do this and it can't slide so it tips over. So alright, let's go out. I'm going to put the camera on it. You see I put lights on it. I've made the lights so you can see them from the back and front. You see that? Because it's important to be able to see when you're coming at you and when you're going away from you. So. Uh, that all works out pretty good. The lights work pretty good on this because it rolls so fast You just have to really be on top of it to see what the left side is, okay? I got full down throttle on it. Got to get to hover mode here. Also, if it's windy, you're going to find it hard to fly back to you, so you need to fly in a knife edge position into the wind. Okay, finger on the switch. Perfect. That's the way to do it. Well, there you go, folks. I hope if you're a new flyer, you may have picked up something in this video that may be useful to you and to the rest of you, the entertainment, as that's what this channel is all about. Thanks kindly for watching, and please take a moment to subscribe. This is the Night Flyer, signing off for now, and watch out for those UFOs. <laughs>